I'd like to ask, start asking you about Lego. What is it about Lego that for decades we just keep on playing with these things, even with technology and everything around us? For me, I know Lego when I was young, but I never played with Lego because 50 some years ago in Hong Kong, so poor, and I mean, our school is so poor. And every month have to waiting for the rice by the red cost. We don't have this kind of money to pay Lego. So by the time we're coming up, uh, I was a cheap stunt guy doing a stunt. So we, we, we never play these kind of things. But like today, I'm first time in Legoland. I said, wow, amazing things. I said, How can they use this kind of thing to do so many different characters? And they make a Lego movie. And a few years ago, they make a Lego movie. I said, Lego, they never move. They, they cannot turn around. Why? How can you make a Lego movie? Then after I saw it, wow, it's so clever. The, the director, the whole team, yeah. so good. And I think, uh, I think people love Lego because it's not just a toy. You feel like you're accomplishing something because you're building something that you can kind of step back and appreciate. And uh, there's something to that. And uh, like he was saying, like you're walking around Legoland and they're taking these tiny little blocks yeah. and constructing these massive things that you know so much time went into it. And it's just, uh, it's admirable and it's, um, yeah, it's, it's, it's incredible. And now we're in our third Lego movie, the two of you play key characters. Let's talk about who Master Wu is and who Lloyd is, at least in your eyes. I, I think if in, in old day, I would be him. <laughs> now I've been making a film 57 years now today, today I become a master Wu then I <clears throat> I just learned from my old master that so much so many teachers teach me all those years I just used the experience in the movie act like a master Wu teach all the children I have so many uh, students I just the normal day concentrate and love the world love the uh, environment uh, love people teach them concentrate to do anything <clears throat> not hurting people martial art is not hurting people it's a protect people that's how i teach him i said for me it's pretty easy i've been doing masters so many years yeah and lloyd he's got a lot going on <laughs> lloyd has a lot going on um i keep saying that this is the most complex character I've ever played, which is uh, crazy to say because it, it is an animated movie. He's so sweet and he means well and he really wants to just figure out who he is and figure out who his dad is. I really enjoyed working on an animated movie just because uh, when you, you're in the recording booth, it's very liberating. You feel, you feel the freedom to be very big and silly and just go for it and not care what anyone thinks. And, um, and then just... Uh, working with all these incredibly talented comedic actors and just sitting back and watching them do their thing because there was a lot of improvisation and so everyone was just able to just say whatever came to mind and uh, I think some of the best stuff in the movie came from those uh, improvisations. And by the way, it must be cool to work with someone like Jackie Chan and having of course. sitting next to you right now. Of course. <laughs> Unfortunately, we were never in the recording booth together, but hundred percent to, to be in a movie with Jackie is uh, it's an honor yeah you mentioned before the choreography Jackie you've been doing that in um, live-action movies for years but I guess when it's animation you can go even further right yes sometimes better than the, 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 the things I think mm -hmm. much much better I wish I'm one of the the Lego can do this kind of spin right now it's so fast and uh, never get hurt also, the, I think the humor in the movie is, is genius, yeah. to, be, to be honest with you. And your character, I think, is hilarious. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Can we talk a bit about that, about how funny the movie is, how entertaining it is, and how, you know, how <clears throat> different it is to other animated movies? You're, talk, you're talking about action, yes. I, 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 I really am more for a lot. You're talking about the dialogue. Sorry, I really listen. I thank you, the director. Jackie, can you say this way? Jackie, can you say that way? Even after recording, I, s I hear the recording room, everybody, ha, 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 I don't know the meaning. <laughs> you <c> <laughs> but you come across so charming and funny in the movie. Yeah, they just, check, Jackie, you, you, then the, probably my colleague translate Chinese, what's the meaning? Then, okay, then I use a different voice. 
different sound, uh, different uh, yeah, brief to, to, to make my character as funny as possible. But the end result, Dave, is, is, is brilliant. It's hilarious. Yeah, so uh, the humor in these Lego movies is so specific and so clever that, I mean, you were saying it earlier that you and your eight-year-old son were laughing equally as hard at everything that was happening on screen, and that's a fine line to walk, and they pull it off so beautifully. And so, like, when I was in the recording booth, it wasn't like I was approaching this like it was a kid's movie. I was saying these jokes and playing them as if I was playing them for my friends who were in their 30s. And, uh, again, I just have so much respect for everyone behind the scenes, and... Uh, yeah, it's just so specific, the humor. And also, uh, Jackie mentioned before how martial arts isn't about fighting, but about defense, but it helps you grow as a person. There are beautiful messages in the movie too, right, yes. Jackie? Uh, that's what I really want to do, because in real life, I teach all my students, or all, all my stunt team, you know, martial art is a protect. It's not attack people, hurting people. And you have to respect anything. Earth, human, uh, anything. Uh, so I think the Lego movie, we should put a lot of message. I know there's so many children like it. We have to put those messages in the movie. Let the young children learn a lot of things. Not just ha 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 ha. It's like a lesson. And there are those lessons, right, Dave, in the movie, the lessons of family, the lessons of the yeah. importance of, of being together, yeah. of defending also your individuality, right? Yeah, so um, there's a message about how we need, to, we need to not take our family for granted. Sometimes, you know, because it's family, we don't work on those relationships, and you need to work on those just like any other relationship in your life and be open to each other and try to understand where each person is coming from. And, um, and then, yeah, Lloyd, Lloyd is also trying to figure out who he is. And he, he thinks that he can start to understand himself better if he starts to understand who his father is. And so that's part of the reason why he really wants to uh, spend time with his father and get to know him. And, and he really believes that there's a good person underneath that evil exterior. And just to finish, because that's his father is Lord Garmadon, and you have a great fight with him in the movie. In your movies, I've seen many of them, one of the things I love about them is that they're, the, the, the fights are so cool, but they're also funny. Like you may pull someone's towel off and hit him with it or something. <laughs> and and we, we saw some of that here in your fight with Garmadon too, right? Yeah, I, I try to because I'm very dilemma. Uh, I like action, but I don't like violence. But, but I always make action movie so this is why I always put comedy in my action mixed together so especially cartoon cartoon is for the children you cannot do do to violent things so I try to put as, as comedy as possible humor in my probably a lot of people doing the verbal humor I have to do the martial art action humor putting it together 